Hey together, Aaron the Black Dragons back and I welcome all of you to Dracula's Castle in Super Smash Bros. Ultimate The World of Life. So we got this over with. Let's start this off. So this is my favorite location by far because of how it is created and what to do in here. And you'll see the gimmick in just a moment. First off, we have to fight against a few redads, and yeah, they they will do that. They will stun us with their stupid down. Don't dodge behind me. Hi there. Whoop. You are dodgy little bastards. Oh come on. Oh yeah, you have super armor, so don't really care about what you're doing here. But whatever, I got them. They're not difficult. They're a little bit frustrating if you get caught inside of this constant whoop attack, but other than that, not, not bad. So, and here we go now with the gimmick. We have this here. Which looks like it did nothing, it returns things to its original state. What does that mean you may ask? Well, you're gonna see in a moment. But first... Hunt Doom! Hmm... Yes! Ready? Go! Enemy Briefs fire, we have a Franklin badge and frankly we don't care anymore. So... We just... We'll be here and take this wolf out. One way or another that is. Goodbye. And uh, not fully, but this way. If you have a fight against an enemy that breathes fire, and it you can't get past it without a Franklin badge, just take a Franklin badge. It makes it easier on yourself. I'm gonna make a lot of the fights easier on myself because I'm playing through this the third time now, so... Hmm. <laughs> so, here we are, we have a cannon! If you had a cannonball, you could probably fire it from here. Hmm, you don't say. This right here looks like a cannonball. Silver cannonball! If only you had a cannon, wonder where we find a cannon. And here we have this thing. I'm gonna run into it. And we are back, so they reset us to the other room, but we still have a cannonball. But they reset us to the beginning of the room, so let's shoot this. And we did it. We don't have any cannonballs anymore, but we shot that thing. So we are here. There's Nightman, but there's also the switch. Beautiful, now we have an opening here. Let's fight against Nightman. Another fi uh, fireman, another um, Mega Man character, so it's time to fight. Ready, go. And here we go. We have more stamina. We actually have a stamina fight where we can just bully the enemy outside of the stage if we wanted to. We don't need to because we deal enough damage as is, but we could if we wanted to. But not always necessary, especially since it's more difficult to bully an enemy outside of a stage if they are metal because they don't lob so far. So a little bit difficult, but you can do it. So next up, who is this Medusa head? Yeah, that thing looks creepy and I love it. Let's fight Filda, Kill Seal and their attack. Kill Seal, if you know the Medusa hands from Castlevania games, that's in a good ability. Ready? Go! And boom! There's a lot of little Mewtwo's and the reasoning for the Mewtwo's is actually really fun because again they can stun you. It fits them 
so well, it's funny. And goodbye. It's not a difficult fight, but it's well themed, I say. I like it, and we got past it super fast, I'm happy about that. So what do we have up here? It's another cannonball, so let's take it just with us. Let's move up here. So we wanna have that fighter right there, so let's go up here because there's a cannonball. Dry Bowser! Nice! Nobody cares about that. Bomberman? Ah. Fire weakness? No. Shooting attack? We don't need any of that. Physical? Yeah, that sounds good. Franklin badge would also be nice. Hmm. Let's take the immunity, however. Ready? Go! The reasoning for going with lava floor immunity is because there is lava floor everywhere. So it's a little bit easier on us if we just deal with that. And we have our counters, so that can help us a good bit here. Because we have the constant flames going off, so we have a constant source that we can counter. Come up here. Goodbye. A super armor while charging our smash attacks really helped us a good bit there. Not the most difficult fight, it can just be annoying if it wants to. But we don't want to, we want to have an easier time with the fight. That's what we're going for here. After all, this is not uh, how to be perfect at Smash, this is just showcasing the game and not doing every fight. That's why I'm not going for 100%. Shoot the cannons! And also why I'm making a lot of the fights easy for myself. Hey Daisy! You in Dracula's castle? That's mostly fitting, I'd say. Beam sword equipped and... Yeah. So this is a fun stage. Boom, Daisy, come here. That was a good time uh, toad counter. I also like that Daisy is actually peeking at what your what toad is doing, where Peach is just completely looking away at it. Daisy is a little bit interested in the carnage. Boom! Wanna come back here? I have something for you. It's a good dodged laser sword. That was so well timed, I'm a little bit annoyed about that. But just a little bit. Wanna do that again? There you go. There we go. Did it. She's a little bit frustrating, but overall, nice enough. Not too difficult. Just as difficult as probably all of the uh, figure fighters, so whatever. Perfect, now we can play as Daisy in the next fight. Daisy, Echo Fighter of Peach, if you don't know. Let's fight against Reaper and Repat. It's Daisy! Ready? Go. And here we go! Oh god, all of the, them have little scythes. I don't care about that. And boom! Oops, did not hit. Oh god, they have dash attack. Well, not dash attacks, they have. You have just something that I really dislike and that's the stupid running deals damage thing that I really hate more than anything else. Just wanna be completely clear about that. It's the most frustrating thing the enemy can have because all they do at that point is just run into you. So annoying. But we did it, nonetheless. Even though it was annoying. Let's flip a switch. Perfect, let's go up here. Fight against Inspired. Yes, please. Hmm. Back shield and landing leg. Yes. Ready? Go! And hi, I'm Daisy. How? I mean, the good thing is that you don't really hit me that much because you try to attack me from behind and guess what? I have a back shield! And I have a... Oh, beautiful! I love it when things like this come together. Stop it! I'm gonna play golf with your buddies. 
if you liked or not. I completely forgot that Peach and Daisy both have beautiful air attacks that I should use more often. Completely forgot about that, because I don't play them so often, but I'm always annoying when I do. So, moving forward, we have Skullman. The thing here on this, if you've noticed, is that you can't really dodge any of the fights, so this is why I wanted to go past the other area so quickly, because I knew that this one was gonna take a little bit longer. Ready? Go! So, you have a Franklin badge, so you reflect projectiles. Good thing I'm a princess, I don't use projectiles. I use my royalty to punch you in the face, because that's just what I am. I mean, I can use projectiles, like this, but why would I? Only will end bad for me. Boom! Good thing is, you're a skull, and I'm a beautiful flower! Whoops, that didn't, didn't go according to plan. That's not a good thing to have. Here, yeah, eat it. I mean, it would have reflected anyway, so what do you even care? Victory! Bye! That was nice. It was a nice little ledge conversation that we had there. All this. Next up we have the mummy. I like it. First we fought the it's basically like you fight against Gipto because I started with the read ads. Nintendo scope? Nay. Staff? No. Well okay. Hello there. That was annoying. The enemy has super armor but moves slowly and they dodge into my direction like the quickest thing ever. There's something that's a little bit annoying. Don't give a character that is super fast, slow and super armor because it does not really do much to them. Does it now? Okay. You're annoying. Stop it. Also, constant grabby going on. Frustrating. Nobody likes constant grabbies. Oh, come on. I mean, I could also do constant grabbies. That was annoying. One of you gone, two of you gone. You're my golf ball now, mummy. Annoying. So, my... Hey! Sit, no! There is a ladder and there's a spirit fighter. Not a spirit fighter, a figure fighter. And we're gonna see who it is in the next episode. So I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. If you did, how about leaving a comment down below? I really would appreciate that. Hope to see all of you to the next part of Super Smash Bros. Ultimate, the castle of Dracula. I mean, world of life. Bye.